Okay, so I'm going to check out this sandwich maker, which is the Sultan, not of the sea, but of the sandwich provisions. And what you do is you just put your sandwich in there. Looks like my bread is too big. Okay, I'll just make one sandwich. Yeah, so let's just see uh, how much actual stuff we can s stuff in there. Yeah, looks like a lot. So, down she goes, and that's not going to fit at all. Alright, so I suppose in uh, three to four minutes, we might have a very groovy sandwich. Yeah. Until then... Let's just look at the fireplace. She's burning good. If I did close this thing, what's going to happen? It's going to squish out all the sides. That's just way too much cheese for anyone's goodness. Can't have that. Okay. Yes, it is the Sultan Sandwich Maker that we all know and love. It makes delicious sandwiches or snacks in minutes. Look at those lovely pictures. A little light on top went out, so uh, I guess that means it's done, or it's near done. <laughs> we'll check it out. Won't we? It's almost closed. We're closing. We're closing. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Close that up. Snap. Come on. Oh. We're going to have a cheese sandwich tonight. Yeah. That's going to be scary. I'm afraid. A little bit afraid. Holy crap. That's the end result. Yeah, a little bit uh a little bit dirty, but I like the dirty. Come on. That's gotta be what the greasiest sandwich I've ever made, so uh yeah, don't use butter next time <laughs> if you're using these things. Alright. Still looks good though. Even if it's a greasy piece of shit. Oh, dropped on the floor. That's how greasy it is. Damn you, sandwich maker. Tastes pretty damn good, though. Gotta admit. Come on. Hot. Mmm. Very hot. That was some uh, serious greasy sandwich action, but man, if you're gonna make them at home, do it this way. It's damn good, damn good. At least you know what you're putting into the sandwich. Hey, yeah.